Um, nothing fancy. I'm just going to type silhouette. Silhouette. I don't, I'm not really concerned right. about size. So I'm just going to put my other text here. And uh, I'm going to name my printer. I don't know. Just type printer. Printer. Something really simple, nothing really serious. Okay, I have in my library a butterfly that I purchased that I'm going to use, that I've been using, this butterfly right here. Just double click on it and it automatically comes into my on my page now as you can see I had two images here but I want to get only want to use this one so I click on the image and then I go to the I come over here think it's in the edit nope in the object box up here and you go down and you ungroup so now they're they should be separate so this was separate so I can just delete that okay so I'm left with oh uh, okay undo I have to put it back together. I have to group it, group it back together. Okay, so go back to object and then go back to group. And my butterfly is back together. Okay, now I'm going to make this a little smaller. Make this a little smaller. I'm going to put that here. And I'm going to rotate it a little bit. I'll slide this over some and then bring this over here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a copy of this. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to Oh, um, it says replicate, replicate to replicate below. Push replicate. So here's the second one that I just replicated. And I pull that down. Just while I'm here, I have this already selected. I'm going to mirror this. Because in order for it to go through the machine, it has to be... going the other way. Let me see flip uh, horizontal. So I flipped it around. I'm do the same thing for this one. So, so everything is ready. So now we ready to cut. I'm gonna swing you back. Okay, it's beginning to cut. Just checking the side. Okay, now I'm going to show you how you pull the paper apart. You know, you just find the edges just like anything else. What else? I'm just going to use a little knife and I'm going to pick up the little accent, the little pieces. See? There you go. Um, okay guys for the sake of this video I'm going to show this is the cover that I made for my silhouette and for the sake of the video I'm going to show you really fast without putting the butterfly down how easy 
It is. So I'm going to still some pieces on here. So I'm going to leave a little bit of room for the butterfly over here. But I'm going to place my silhouette here and I'm going to, the butterfly is going to be over here somewhere. Because it's starting to get a little later and the kids will be home and this video will be over. So, okay. My iron is on, is on cotton and it's on dry heat. No steam. And they said to hold it for about a minute. 40 to 60 seconds. Just firmly press down with the iron. Okay guys, I'm done ironing out my uh, lettering for my printer. Uh oh, it's getting darker. As you can see, uh, it's fairly light, but I can see it. And it's just easy as that. I'm going to show you, spin you around and show you my silhouette. It's right here. And there we are right there. I can you can see this one a little bit better since the printer was so far away. And there you have it. So this is Naima from You Do It Craft. Thank you for watching.